a new ministry in the Diocese of Texas, a cohort of coaches. Jesus never expected us to do ministry on our own. God always provides us with companions on the way as we do the ministry God calls us to do. In the Diocese of Texas, we have an abundance of leaders who are gifted in walking with us as we seek to do God's work. As we continue to form disciples as effective agents of transformation, we are beginning a new initiative of training leaders to be these companions, specifically as coaches to congregations, to vestries, and to clergy. Coaching for any human endeavor is not so different than coaches we see in sports. Picture in your mind the image of a coach standing next to the athlete they have been training with. The athlete is about to enter the field, and the coach's job is to help the athlete tap into their innate capability to accomplish more than she may have thought possible. Coaches of all kinds are called to such work. The task of the coach is not to take on the challenge themselves, but to help the coachee find the potential within them to meet whatever challenge may lie ahead. This is done through a coaching process that enlightens the person being coached to certain practices that will help them accomplish their goals by establishing accountability and setting deadlines. The coach in training, you will learn the basic components of being an effective coach. You'll learn how to use your presence to best assist the coachee, how to listen well, ask powerful questions, assist the coachee in expanding possibilities, and help them plan for action. We hear throughout scripture that we are called to help others. By helping to move people's lives and ministries forward in new and expanding ways, we are helping to raise up God's agenda as well. We all know that God is the one true agent of change and that answers already lie within scripture. But being in a role of a coach and asking powerful questions that someone may have never even considered before helps to stir the possibilities that lie deep within us all already. A coaching relationship is a sacred triad between you, the person you're coaching, and of course, Jesus. Jesus is always at the center of our coaching relationship because coaching really is a sacred time where people come together to move God's work forward. And as a coach, you get to steward that sacred time and place. Jesus is often thought of as a servant, a teacher, and of course our savior. But have you ever really thought about Jesus as a coach? Jesus coached his disciples. He expanded his work of the kingdom of God through Peter, James, John, and others by challenging them to take risks and to do things they never thought possible. Jesus challenged his apostles with questions, far more than providing just answers. And we think he understood that to reflect and struggle is often better than just providing all the answers sometimes. You can walk that same path with Jesus. The person being coached is actually a disciple in the making. They are being formed just as Jesus did with his own disciples. Is God nudging you to be one of the Diocese of Texas cohort of coaches? A coach is a partner in ministry rather than the expert or the advisor. A coach asks powerful questions, listens deeply, assists in goal setting and ensures accountability. A coach encourages the person or persons with whom they are sharing ministry to discover their own best solutions. Does this sound like something you may already be doing? The Diocese of Texas coaching cohorts will be trained in groups of eight persons after four two-hour sessions, all done via video conferencing on the internet these trained coaches will be authorized by the diocese to coach in all sorts of situations from stewardship to best practices for vestries to conflict resolution to visioning to most any other opportunity you can think of. As time goes on, coaching cohorts will continue to gather by video conferencing periodically as they begin their ministry for mutual support and to continue to fine tune coaching skills. Do you think this might be a ministry that matches your passions and giftings? If so, let's talk. You can reach out to us at epicenter.org slash coaching. There you will find details about coaching in the Diocese of Texas. We look forward to hearing from you.